Oh, yes. Morning, dear God. We are the blessed. Thank you. For what you've done for us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We lift up our voices in prayer and thanksgiving and honor and glory and majesty. And my God, Lord, we thank you, dear God. Father, we count it a privilege here, our cross to bear, Lord. Father, we thank you, Lord God, all the days of our lives. Father, we pray that you might bless me in a very special way. Yes, Lord. 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 Father, today is a, yes, a busy, Lord. going to be a busy day, and she's not well, dear God. We yeah. bless her in a very special please, way. Lord. Help her and those that are trying to help her out, Lord God. Help them yes, in yes, very yes, special yes, ways, and this day will be, my God, Lord, go go as planned, dear Father. Yes. Bless her, Lord God. Yes. Bless her in a body, Lord. Touch her. Yes. 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 Glory to God. Bless the yes. sermon, dear Father. Yes. My God, Lord, may it be food for our soul, Lord. Yes, yes, yes. And we will go a little bit farther, Lord God. And we will praise you a little bit uh, uh, louder. And my yes. God, we can, we can fight a little bit longer, Lord yes. God. Mighty yes. grace to have from God. In Jesus' name, we Father, pray. Bless. Amen. Amen. Book of Jeremiah, please, chapter 50. I want to exhort the saints this morning. We'll have a small meeting after the service. And of course, we have the service in the streets, street meetings. It's a busy day to day. But we do thank God for his goodness. Thanks to God. Amen. Evidently, on Friday, there was an accident yeah. uh, near the Walmart there. I saw a bunch of police cars out there. Evidently, a little girl got hit and dragged from the car that hit her. Uh, and we, uh, our heart. Children always a sad thing. Well, you know what? That could have been your child. Do you want to know that? Because it's somebody's child. Somebody's grandchild. I got grandchildren. It's somebody's great grandchild. And we pray for them, don't we? But we're glad that God spread out to them, isn't that right? Mothers, in your devotion in the morning, set aside a time. To thank God that your children are healthy. Yeah. 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 That they are, amen, happy in, yeah. amen, in the church of God. Yeah. And they didn't get drugged by a car down near Walmart. Yeah. Thank God some, that happened to somebody. Thank God that your child is not molested. Yeah. Or not yeah. snatched. Yeah. Or not abused. Because that yeah. happened to somebody. That's yeah. true. Lord help so mothers and fathers, thank God. Yes. Amen. For protecting your family. For protecting your family. Amen. 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 Did nobody snatch you as a child? True, true. And sold you off to Canada via Peru, via South Africa somewhere. It happened every day. They have slavery going on today. Do you all know that? Yes, they do. But God protected you. So if you don't thank God, I am. Thank the Lord this morning for God for protecting you. Because it might have been some purpose looking at you when you was a child. True. Yes, sir. Searching you out. Okay. They don't care, boy, bro. They don't care. Amen. Searching you out. Scoping you out. But God rebuked that spirit. Amen. Thank you, God. So we're yes. ready for that. Thank you, God. People are snatched every day. True. Children every day. There was one old devil possessed man. He was a cousin up there in Alaska where I visited some years ago, Anchorage, where I flew into. Found out, amen, that he killed. The, the, the eight year old girl, 13 year old girl, and the mother slit their throats and raped them. Man, that's something. They always pick on the smallest, isn't that right? The ones that can usually bother. They don't pick on no big, tough guy. You know, but doing that could have been, but God spared you and I. Praise the Lord. You know how God mercy this morning. Praise the Lord. Well, somebody say God this morning. Amen. Amen. Well, you, you deserve work. God bless your soul. True, true, dear God. I'm not by myself here. Amen. God is worthy, isn't he? Amen. 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 The price that you paid is not worthy of some praise every now and again. Yes, That's sir. What was that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm going to praise God sometimes. How about you? Amen. In public, praise the Lord. Amen. In public, I'm going to praise God. Amen. So that people know what God has done for me, and I'm not worthy, but God just had mercy in me. Amen. Amen. That's so true. If you would please, Jeremiah 50. It won't be a long exhortation, and we'll go on the meeting and the outside activities. Read on, please. Jeremiah 50. My people 
hath been lost sheep. Their shepherds, Their shepherds have caused them to go astray. Go astray. They have turned them away on the mountain. On the mountain. They have gone from mountain to hill. They've gone from mountain to hill. They oh, have forgotten place. their resting place. Yes. Oh. I thought this morning. Read again, please, if you would kindly, verse 6 again. My people have been lost sheep. And I'm reading Jeremiah chapter 15, verse 6. Read on. Their shepherds have caused them to go astray. Their shepherds have caused them to go astray. They right. have turned them away on the mountain. Yes. They have gone from yes. mountain to hill. Yes. They have forgotten their resting place. I thought this morning in brief, amen, mountains, hills, and valleys. You know, the mountain is the highest place on earth. You can't go any higher than the mountain. True. Mount Everest, what, 37,000? Kilimanjaro Mountains. That's the highest point you can get to. In Alaska, there's a mountain. I forget the name of it right offhand, but they got a big mountain there. You can see it from almost all over the lower part of the state. Mount Kilimanjaro? Oh, that's Africa. But a mountain is the highest as you can get. And then, especially speaking, we want to maintain our mountaintop experience. <laughs> Not things that are always going good, but we always are on top of the devil. Amen. Yes, Serving God. Yes, yes, Let me take a side note here. Now, saints of God and friends, the devil, and I'm going to expose him this morning. So we'll know how to fight him. Yes, yes, yes. Is trying to bring us down as a congregation. Yes, yes. Worldwide, yes. local church, and also on an individual basis. Yes. The devil does not prop up. He always does what? Pull it down. Yes. And he has a history of that. Yes. And he works very subtly. To bring you down to not always to a blatant sin, but to bring you down to where God is not pleased any longer. Amen. Now notice, brother, Adam and Eve had a, a paradise on earth, so to speak. They had what they needed, and God came down to tuck them in the cool of the day. But the devil brought them what? Down. Next thing we know, they're pushed out of the garden Amen. on their own, working the field, and, and the ground was closed up on them. Wouldn't give them what, what they wanted them to grow. So the devil wants to bring people down to a lower place. So we have, we have mountains, we have hills, and we have valleys. So Israel was on the mountain. They had power with God, enemies. Amen. Were backed up. Yeah. The enemies couldn't. Amen. Stand. I mean, too much for overwhelming enemies. Kings were bringing gold and silver. Remember, Sheba brought gold and silver. Yeah. Amorites defeated. Hittites defeated. Philistines all defeated because they were on the mountain. Thank God, Mount Zion. Yeah. And they were uh, reigning wonderfully because God was with them. And we're not talking about so much a place now, but an experience. Jesus said, there was a spirit and truth. Not a mountain, but in spirit and truth. So it's a spiritual height you want to have. And we know the saints of God, then notice the verse. It says they went, Lord have mercy, help us this morning. They went from mountain to what? Hill. hill. Now, a hill is still high. But it's not what? A mountain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They may not have gone back to, uh, amen, the dance hall and uh, fighting their wives and liquor, but they just came down a little lower than what is expected. And they reigned there for a while, theoretically, but the devil bring you down from Mount the Hill, he wants to bring you down to the valley. Uh, let's look at briefly, please, 2 Kings 23. Remember, David was a great king. I respect him highly. I'm not worthy to wash his chosen socks, so to speak. But amen, he was a strong king. He was a warrior and administrator. About the sweet songs, made instruments. He was a prophet and a preacher. 
He was riding high, but the devil was saying, I want to bring him a little bit down. And he did. So if you're going now we know it be works. Before he take people out, he first bring them down. So Israel went from the mountain a little lower to the hill, then he got them down to the valley. The valley, by nature, does not have the light the mountain has, because it's a lower point. That's right. And usually, it's a bit muddy. Mm. It's a little bit dank, because water goes to where? The lowest point. And it's always a bit marshy, and mosquitoes and all that. So there's a danger in the valley. Read on, please. 2 Kings 23. Verse 10. And he defiled Topheth, yes. which is in the valley of the children of Hinnom. It's in the where? The valley of the children of Hinnom. We don't believe it. That no man might make his son or, yes. his, daughter or his daughter to pass through the, through the fire to Molech. So they begun at Mount Zion where their children were a blessing. They moved to the hill where they were not so much a blessing. And in the valley, they burned them in the fire. And if you read in the book of Jeremiah, during the siege, Nebuchadnezzar founded the Israel camp, Israel, for what, two and a half years? After that, the city was broken up. They were eating their own children. Mm -hmm. May God help us, brother. They were eating angel food at one point. My God. Man from heaven at one point. Yeah. Now they're eating their own children. Can you imagine? My God. What happened? They went from mountain to heal, and now down to that. Thank you, God, and friends, the devil's desire to try to bring people down. Not a lot, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh my God. They tried it on Christ. The devil tried about it. You don't know that. You won't try it. You told me I'm that. He was on the cross, paying for my addiction. Mm. On the cross. Paying for my lustful life. Mm -hmm. On the cross, paying for my gambling addiction. Right and they told him, why don't you come on down and save yourself? Yeah. But he didn't do that. My God. In fact, he stayed up there. Yeah. And wanted to be up there. Pray to be up there. My God. Desire to be up there. In fact, you could not have brought him down. My Lord. He wanted to be there. And I'm glad he did not come down. Thank you, God. And you shouldn't be too, praise the Lord. Because if he had not come down, he might have been the hell today. Amen. True, true. But he stayed up there. Stuck it out. Went through the bleeding. Went through the pressure. But I can't imagine what happened back then. That's above my pay scale. But he, he, he went through all of that. I can't imagine how it feels to be whipped on your back. To be spit in your face. God. To be, amen, put up, now, amen, to have people put nails, I can't even, uh, uh, hang, uh, a hangnail hurts me, doesn't hurt you? Yeah, yeah. They're going to put a nail in my hand, oh, and in my feet, then I hang on that for six, eight hours, I can't imagine that. And he was not guilty. My Lord. Now you and I were guilty. Right. Come on. You were guilty, I said. True, Lord. And I was too. But brother, he did no sin. He knew what God found in his mouth. But he obeyed his father. I'm glad you didn't come down, Lord. I know you went through. I know it was horrendous. The Bible said, please, Lord, to bruise him. It was a bloody mess. But I'm glad you didn't come down. Thank you. Thank you. you stand up. Now I can stay up. Praise the Lord. Amen. You're up. I can be up. Amen. I can stay up. God will put you up and keep you up. You all know that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Unto Him. He able. I said unto Him. My God, yes, Lord. Let the new life keep you from the world. And let you what? Fall into the throne. He will keep you from falling. Babylon does not preach that. That's true, brother. They said we're going to sin more or less every day. Well, that's your experience. Thank God, not mine. God saves. To keep on the mountain. Amen. Let's sing that song. Not sing it. Give me a song. Just the words. Uh, song 102. 
There's an evening light going on the mouth. Which one is the evening light? Before we close, one or two. What is that? Is that? I think it's 102 in the what? In the. Yes, it's 102 hymnal, I think. Is that it? The song says, I am dwelling. On the mountain. Dwelling. Katakoi Kesai. I'm there permanently. There's no coming or going. There's no going up or down. People today used to be on the mountain. Mm. But they might got disillusioned. They might have gotten hurt or whatever. But that's caused them to come down from what they used to hold. Yeah. But thanks to God and friends, whenever you come down, what you used to hold, they'll lack power. Feel that inspiration. And you gotta ask yourself, if this is true, then what was that? Yeah. And that's what we're gonna some confusion. So if God is blessing you, and He is. Yes, sir, yes, sir. I say and He is. Yes, Come on, my God. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. He is inspiring me, He is. He's inspiring you. Yes. So you come down. Mm. It may not be clear sometimes. Sometimes the clouds can cover the mountain. We were in Montana, brother. It was fantastic. The clouds was coming down the mountain. It was astounding. The clouds, witnesses, of what God can do. They are with the mountain. You, know, you can do it. I did. You can make this thing. Beautiful sights of the cloud on the mountain. But dear one, the devil should come down just a little bit to reduce the inspiration. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But brother, we need inspiration more than ever. You know that. Not judgmentalism, but inspiration will bring what understanding about God's word. We need that. We all need that. But when they come down, we see not many are saved anymore. Not much inspiration anymore. And as far as healings, that's all but gone. What happened? They came down from that high Mount Zion place, down to a mountain, and they're going down in a valley. Yeah. And they'll be eating their own children sooner or later. Right? Oh my God. We know this. Yeah. I am dwelling on the mountain. Yes. Where the golden sunlight gleams. Oh, sunlight. Walking in sunlight. He's the light of God. What Christ says, you walk in the light. Is what? He's in the light. You have what? Fellowship with another. And what the love of Christ does what? From all sin. Read on, please. Or a land whose wondrous beauty, wondrous beauty far, exceeds far exceeds my fondest dream. Fondest dream. Where the air is oh, pure. The and pure. Oh, the, the inspiration is clear. The atmosphere is clear. The inspiration is clear. Read on, please. Laden with the breath of flowers. My smell is good. Thank God, the flowers of God, the scent. Sacrifice. When you sacrifice, God smells that wonderfully so. Read on, please. They are blooming by the fountain. Oh, they're blooming their growth. I think there's some growth there. You experience some growth. Read on, please. Meet the amaranthine bars. Yes. First number two. I can see far down the mountain. Yeah. Can you see far down the mountain? Can you see them down there? I hope you can. I hope you can. I hope you see how far down we used to be. My Amen. True, true. I hope you see that. And cling to the mountain. Cling to God, cling to God, cling to God. Amen. Read on, please. Where I wandered weary years. We were wandering from man. Some ran from woman to man, and some ran from both. Oh ran from the bottle. Some ran from hills to false religion. Mm -hmm. This church, that church, Unitarianism. They believe there's no sin. Everybody won't be saved, no matter what they do. Southern Baptist, I see you see me all say, can't help it. Treasure, treasure God in Christ. They speak in tongues, 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 tongues. Jehovah's Witness, it's a work of salvation. Southern Baptists, no women preachers, no holiness. Catholics, men, Mother Mary is immediate. You've got a man. you got to do the rosary and confess to the priest. Brother, they've they gone way down, way down, and still going down. 
often hindered in my journey, in my journey by the ghost of doubts and fears, and fears. We don't broken vows and disappointments, yes. thickly sprinkled all the way. Here's the good news. But, but the, the Spirit, Spirit led God. erring yes, to the, the land. land I hold Is today. Is not this the, the land, land of Beulah? Thank God for going there. He told John, come on up. He told Moses, come on up. Peter, come on up, Transfiguration Mountain. But then when they got him up to stay, so many were up. One individual called a couple years ago. He was a mighty exhorter, mighty exhorter. Man, he would, he would my hair stand on end sometimes. Just the inspiration. It maybe 34 years ago. Then Brother Moon, I'm down to a church. It's a Church of God in Christ here, where I live. I'm down in fellowship. And that man used to go forth with this gospel. And then he began to, uh, you know, just come down a little bit. A bit. All the way down. I, I, I watched his descent. Because mm. I loved him. He preached me years ago. But I, I just began to, to be fixated on how it happened and how it was a subtle thing. It was step by step, day by day, sometimes bright, sometimes cloudy, but it was still continual to sin. Father, help us this morning. Yes, Lord. Amen. Maybe he didn't see it at first. Couldn't sense it at first, but it was still going down. You know, how many have been in elevator? You've been in elevator before? You've been in elevator before? Yes, elevator. yes. yes. <laughs> Somebody a little favorite sometime, I think. But <laughs> you know when you're going down, right? You can do what? Feel it. And you know when you're going where? Up. You can do what? Feel it. Stay in spiritual. Got to be able to do what? Feel it. I'm on the 35th floor. I'm on the 20th floor. We still up high. Just got a few. But I know when I'm coming down. Yes, I'm still high. I can still see tops of other hills, but oh I'm not where I used to be. May God help me. Oh my God. I'm not where I was. Oh I'm above Babylon, above Harry Christian, but I'm not where I was. So I got to go up. I got to go up. I got to go up. Well, I don't care what you say. I got to go up. When you're going up, now, today, and this time, Lord, I'm making I'm going to stay up there forever. Forever, I said, my God, help us. Yes, I'm dwelling. Catholic court case. I'm dwelling. I'm dwelling. I'm living there. I'm there to be forever. Yes. And a day. Thank the Lord. Thank you. Lord. But God got to keep you. Yes, Lord. You all know that. Yes, so God. So God got to keep you. But our God will all fall. True. I say we'll all fall. True. Yeah. True. So will Lord help us today? And I believe He will. In fact, I know he will. Amen. In fact, I know he wants to. Amen. Because there was nobody, see, nobody plans to go down. True. Theoretically. True, that's true. But through choices, in your windows, being around the wrong crowd at the wrong time, and people do influence you. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Yes. Amen. 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 Lot was influenced. Amen. Judas was influenced. Amen. Amen. So we got to be careful who we are hanging around in the church of God. Amen. Well, I was lonely sometime, I know. I know. Well, you're lonely, so I understand that. I understand that. But that's the part of suffering for Christ's sake. Lord, I'd rather be by myself than come down the mountain. Amen. Right. And God will visit you sometime. Amen. You all know that? Amen. Amen. <laughs> He'll come and check on you. Praise the Lord. So I'm going to pray. If you're up on the mountaintop, praise the Lord. Amen. But pray, Lord, keep me. Yes, Lord. Some things may not seem important. If you did it 30 years ago, you got to do it now. Because that is by your soul. So if you're up there, I thank God for you. You can pray, Lord, keep me. Lord, I feel spiritual gravity trying to pull me down. 
Gravity is real. Yes, it is. Amen. Whatever goes up, some say what? Must, Must come, come down. down. Yeah. Gravity is real. That's the law. Yeah. Now, that's the law. Yeah. It's going to happen. Yes. And, all, and you can feel that spiritual gravity sometimes. True, yeah. Lord. True. The Lord, I, I want to keep climbing, Lord. Sometimes the crowd, that's good. Hey, brother, praise the Lord. Sometimes smaller crowd. Hey, brother, hey, brother. Sometimes by yourself. On that cross, it was all by himself. Nobody, you know, his family left him far off. His father, he said, why is God forsaken me? Peter had run off. I'm sorry he was there all by himself. You know, it's bad enough when you're, by, when you're in pain like that yeah. and, and bleeding like that. Yeah. And nobody said, uh, here's, a, here's a napkin for the blood. Yeah. Nobody said, here's some cold water. Nobody said, cover it up! Nobody said, let's pray for yeah. Nobody said that. One of them said, uh, come down if you so you say you are. And they wagged their heads. But something inside of them, praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Something inside of them, deep down. Yes. Kick them up there, right? Amen. What was it? Love. Oh my God. Love for the world, thank God. Yeah. And love for you, praise the Lord. Amen. And they kept them up there. Yes. Yes. Time to come down, he came on down, but he rose and ran. And he's up, right hand to the Father. We read it between me and God, mediate between you and the Lord, mediate, I mediate toward. We'll say we're in prayer this morning. I know we feel the gravitational pull from family, from friends, from backsliders, some unwise saying sometimes, amen, 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 amen. Amen. But that's all right. You just keep going up, right? Amen. Don't charge, just keep on going up. Don't charge, it's all, it's, it's all good, and it's all right. The Bible says all things does what? Work together. Work together. Good. Look, come on, look at CP. Let me pray for all. Amen. It works together for good to those who what? Love God and what else? Amen. So we'll take a time to pray. Let's stand this morning. Thank the Lord. Amen.